So here we have a metahuman and we want to export him and set him up in Marvelous Designer. Sorry, let me turn on the textured lit version. When creating a metahuman, in Metahuman Creator, we want the model to have the least amount of clothes possible. Otherwise, portions of his limbs and torso won't be available. In order to add clothes to the metahuman in Marvelous Designer, we need to export his body mesh and head mesh. The body and head mesh are easy to navigate to in the Blueprint viewport. Go to the body under Root in the Component section. Then I like to go to the Mesh section in the Detail panel and click the icon for Browse to Asset. Then you should see it in the, in the Content tab. Right click the MetaHuman body and go to Asset Actions, Export. And then Settings should be fine. Uh, just make sure the preview mesh is exported too. So to toggle that on in the options in the export section. Then we can do the same for the face mesh. Go to the components section and click on the face. Then go to the details panel in the mesh section and click that browse the asset icon again. Once again, you should be able to see the head in the content tab. Same steps as before. We'll go ahead and export the head. Next, we need to import the MetaHuman head and body into another 3D app. In this case, I am using Maya, but this step should be the same for most 3D apps. If you are getting crash problems from importing both head and body, import one at a time. Then export the mesh without a rig as an OBJ. Finally, import the OBJs into your 3D app. That should keep everything stable. Now we need to combine the head and body. Before this, I remove the extra geometry in the face. We won't need eyes, lashes, and the inner mouth, inner mouth parts. It's not necessary, but it keeps the mesh light and easy to import and export. Once that's done, we select both head and body and combine the meshes. Delete the history afterwards, then export the combined mesh as an OBJ. Now we can close Maya and open Marvelous Designer. In Marvelous Designer, go to File, Import, OBJ as an Avatar. Navigate to the combined MetaHuman that you made, and then open it. In the Import OBJ options, the most important things are the scale, which uh, I come, I'm coming from Maya, so it's centimeters. Then toggle on Align Bottom to Ground. Click OK. Disregard the warning on my screen. You shouldn't get that. I am running programs in the background, so my memory is maxed out right now. And here is the combined MetaHuman. For this example, I'm grabbing some pants that are available in the closet store. Uh, and so this will most likely not align when I select them. It's very easy to work with though. First, I grab the clothing set by selecting the whole pattern and then move it to where it aligns better to the MetaHuman in the 3D window. Then I grab parts of the pattern for the back of the clothes in the 3D viewport and move them where I think they will work best. Also, pull the parts away from the body so when the simulation is on, it won't go right through the MetaHuman avatar. And now we're gonna do the same for the side parts of the pattern and the front parts of this pattern. Depending on the complexity of the outfit, you may be here for a longer time getting things in place so that they can simulate correctly. Now I just turn on the simulation and presto. Mostly good to go with a few tweaks here and there. And it should be that simple to get a metahuman and a marvelous designer to create clothes. Once you're done, select the outfit pattern only and export it with the settings that work best for you. Uh, thanks for watching. Any questions, please let me know in the comments section. Bye for now.